I think I have the answer, but it's like really long-winded and annoying. But I don't see what's wrong with it. Looks like a good answer to me. Mm -hmm. Go Factor. Good job, Mr. Hardbiz. Yeah, so I'm not sure of the response. I think mm -hmm. it's um, rook a8. Okay, then let's say bishop takes. Then I was going to go... I guess I don't really have to go rook. I guess my answer is wrong. I was going to go rook e4 and then swing it over. Well, you could play rook e4 now. That's yeah, what just, I just said. But just king g8 and... Queen G5, Queen all right, G6. All right, my streak is over. Yeah, somebody suggested this. My answer is really long and complicated, so I don't think it's right because it's it's too long and complicated. I think this mm. is the answer. And that threatens rook takes rook. And if you play bishop here, you lose your bishop. Bishop here, I think queen takes wins immediately. And after rook takes, I take with the queen. Then you have to play rook A8. Then I play queen C3. You have to play rook B8. <laughs> then I play queen A5 with the idea of queen here, and there's just no defense to that. If you play queen g5, queen c7, queen d, and I take the queen, then take the bishop. So that's, I think this is the answer. Okay, I didn't look at any of that right. My answer is really long, so it's probably not right. This is, seems wrong. right. Then I take with the queen. This is my answer so far. Yeah, then I wanted to go here and here and here. Oh, I'm done, 32, 43. So, so let me show you what, my, what the rest of it would be. That was the answer. Okay, so I thought he would go here, then I would go here, and the thing is I can go here, threatening this and this also. Then I thought he would go here to defend. Now this wins, but this also wins, because I'm threatening the bishop and the rook. But my, 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 my idea was this, and then I take the bishop. But, I, I, but it was too easy to win after here. And then bishop c6 or bishop c8, I take this. And then rook here, you play queen here. So it just, there's nothing he can do. He's lost. He's going to lose his bishop or lose his rook. I can't wait to get some of that factor food food in the mail. Mm hmm You got to wait two weeks. Or actually, not two. No, it should be yeah, two, two weeks. No, no, it's two weeks. We uh, have until the 8th to change it. Okay. Then on the 14th, it gets here. Okay. Oh, it's not two weeks. I thought it was I, I, thought, I thought 14 plus 2 is 14. Yeah. 14 plus 2 is 14. Remember that. No, it'll be here in 12 days. Okay. But I I, I thought 14 plus 2 was, was 14. You barely get it now even after Ben's showing it. Yeah, it's 32.43, so you're not... Yeah, that one was too hard. I have a funny story. In 1993, I visited Kaidenov in Lexington as part of the Sanford Fellowship to get chess coaching. And I solved some puzzle that nobody's ever solved, and he couldn't solve it when he did it. And then I came back and I showed the Ann Arbor Chess Club, which has experts and masters everywhere. I showed them the answer and they were like, what? Now what? Like I was done. And then they were all like 2,000, 2,200 and they had no idea like why that was the answer after I showed them. That sounds good, Ben. It was just too hard. Vegan burger, chickpeas, onions, garlic, cilantro. Uh oh, I, ho I hope, uh, I hope what's his name's not here. Uh, Peter. Charlotte Chess Center, don't read that. He's going to have to read about cilantro. No. Uh